Oh gosh, what's happening? Wait, put me down a little bit. for a walk today to the dockyard yeah yep, it's, it's about an hour's walk uh, from the boat and uh, is it, are we going to get the, the trail trail no there's no no railway trail up this part yeah. it finishes in Somerset oh, okay yeah yep. so it's a job for another day yes and see if we're gonna get some lunch aren't we that's takeaway that's, that's challenging yeah <laughs> yeah we might get uh, takeaway something you know yeah yeah that would, would be nice yeah no cooking! No cooking! <laughs> Yay! In 1809, work began on the construction of the Royal Naval Dockyard and continued into the early 20th century. It was a huge project that involved the labour of thousands of convicts from Britain who were housed in appalling conditions aboard rotting hulks of former naval ships. The naval base was officially closed in 1995. Today, Dockyard is the most visited site in Bermuda, underscoring the value of the architectural heritage to the tourism industry. Beautiful teak, teak decks, stunningly beautiful. It was also the home of the 2017 America's Cup. Chris, who is one of our patrons, and over the dock that we were staying in, took us for a tour of the island. Built in 1844 by the Royal Engineers, the Gibbs Hill Lighthouse is the taller of the two lighthouses on Bermuda, and one of the first lighthouses in the world to be made of cast iron. The optics consist of a Fresnel lens from 1904 revolving on steel bearings. However, for most of its history, the lens revolved on a bed of 1,200 pounds of mercury. The light's focal plane at Gibbs Hill is at 354 feet above sea level. Aircraft can see its flashes from over 100 miles away. Somerset Bridge was originally constructed in 1620. This is the smallest drawbridge in the world and only opens wide enough for a mast. In the 20th century, the bridge went through some major renovations, but much of its basic construction has been retained. This little wooden flap opens up and you can still take your boat through. Where's your boat? Where's your house? You wanted to come out, so now you're out. You're yeah, happy. Okay. okay, come on then. Let's go. Home. In. Come on, Daddy. Do you want to go in? Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, let's go then. Ooh. That was really scary, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> His heart is just pumping. I'm going up on the mast today, yeah, 
to put the main halyard so I have to go really on the top, 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 top so I have the camera on my head that is going to be pairing with my phone so Simon can give me instructions if you get up so that that pull is here uh -huh. I'll have to slacken this Okay. so that you, you might have to pull it out slightly okay. yeah, to get it up as we do not have a main halyard, only the topping lift goes to the top of the mast. For the last six feet, Carla will only be on one rope. Okay. You can see it. You got it. Oh shit, good. It's too too high somewhere. We can get me up there, I'll tell you. I was ready to quit when I had to put the strap on it. I was like, oh I'm gonna quit. Then I thought, oh that guy's gonna charge too much money, I'm going up. <laughs>
hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah, we went on a nice walk. Uh, one of the first walks we had after our quarantine, really. Yes, go uh, all the to, way to, to dockyard. dockyard. <laughs> and Dockyard is absolutely spent spectacular. It's beautiful. Yeah, it was built by the British for the Royal Navy after the uh, independent war in America because they didn't really have anywhere to keep their boats. And it is absolutely stunning in all its ways. It's, yeah, I very, mean, very tidy, very, very well uh, kept, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, unfortunately, uh, because of the uh, virus situation, yeah. um, it was basically closed, but we did manage to get a little bit of lunch. Yeah, we did. In a takeaway shop, didn't we? <laughs> it's all very dead because the, all, the whole town is very dead because it, the, no one is going uh, anywhere, backs and forwards no, and, and no, no one is arriving, no. the airports are closed. So yeah. it's just us basically in yep. the island. We're the only tourists. Yeah. And I would actually have loved to have seen the America's Cup here. Uh, the boats look absolutely fantastic, uh, the ones standing there. And it, was uh, just it would a bit have been left brilliant. over there, isn't it? Yeah, there was yeah. just a few bits and pieces yeah. left around which you, you could uh, uh, look at and yeah. see. It must have been an absolutely spectacular sight. Yeah. And then after that, uh, we got on with the maintenance, and Carla had to go to the top, top of the top the of the mast. mast. <laughs> <laughs> it's an horrendous job because. Uh, well, we don't do well with heights. No, neither, neither, neither of us do well the, with heights. No. no. And uh, it's 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 good until the second stage, but after that, it just gets just you know. I I thought twice. I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna say I'm not going. But then, you kind of think how much they're gonna charge you to go yeah. there, and then yeah. we go like, oh, okay, let's do yeah. this. <laughs> In fact, what you didn't see in the video was uh, was that Carla had to go up there again, we had, uh, yes, twice, second time, because the draw line that we put in slipped down the side of the block in the top of the mast, and then when we tried to pull the halyard through, it, it wouldn't go over the top; it just banged against it. So, so we tried everything. I, I had to go twice. <laughs> <laughs> you were a bit quicker the second time, though, weren't you? Yes, very yeah. quick. And yeah. I, I went very high up to get the to get the line out of the mast. <laughs> 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 yeah, but it was a horrible job. And, yeah. and then uh, I had to go uh, the third time to do the jack lines. Yeah, yeah I had to go and do the but jack that, lines that, as well. But that high is okay. Yeah. It's not that bad. No. But that, but I did the job really yeah. quick, didn't you I? Did. <laughs> you did. And so we got a new halyard in and yeah. uh, we sorted out the reasons why the halyard snapped, which had absolutely nothing to do with the halyard whatsoever, but something to do with the uh, lazy line on the top of the uh, mainsail. And so that's also been fixed. Yeah. The so we know what there. we're doing. The sails are uh, in. So yeah, sales are one. We're yeah. all good. Yeah, good. Ready yeah. to go. Yeah. And uh, then we went to uh, have a little look at Hamilton. And Hamilton. Uh, right yeah. here from uh, where we're anchored in Cavella Bay, uh, you just walk around the other side and there's a ferry port. Yes, it takes us to Hamilton. It's a yeah. beautiful, beautiful journey. Yeah, it is. Absolutely yeah. stunning. Yeah. You really get to see the island. Yeah. In fact, the buses and the ferries. It's the best way, it's to, the best way to, to see, see an island. island. Don't bother yeah. with a sort of taxi no, thing, you know, no, a, a no. thing. Just it's get the bus. And yeah, uh, Bermuda is just wonderful. I wasn't yeah. expecting. Simon always told me Bermuda is beautiful, but it is beautiful. Yeah, it's it is wonderful. an absolutely yes. beautiful island. It's yeah. so well kept. Everywhere yeah. you go, yeah. it's nice and clean. And the people are absolutely All the delightful. houses are so well yeah. painted. And yeah. with the white roofers, it's just yeah. it's just amazing. It's yeah. just the contrast is amazing, amazing. beautiful, yeah. yes. Yeah. People are very, very helpful, very yeah. welcoming. Yes. Yeah. yeah. OK, well, thank you very much for following. Yes, thank you very much for following us. Uh, if you can click on, click on the button to subscribe, we would appreciate that. And uh, yeah, thank you very much. See you next time. Bye.